Anno asked me to come find you. He said it's quite urgent. All he wanted me to do is track you down and send you to him. Look, this is important. Even more important than wiping out the Ash Spawn. Please, go speak to the Second Counselor as soon as possible. Thank you for coming. After everything you've already done for Ravenrock, I hate to ask for more, but I can't risk Councillor Morvain being killed. The Ulan family of House Lalu, a rival great house, has placed a death mark on the Councillor's head. It's a private matter. Let's just say they seek revenge for the execution of one of their own. Ordered by Councillor Morvain himself. The problem is I don't have any solid proof that anyone from House Lalu is hidden among us. Only my suspicions. It may be justified, but it certainly isn't appreciated. Councillor Morvain simply feels that I'm being paranoid. I'm afraid that one day I'll awaken and discover him dead. I don't want it to come to that. I do. I've received some information from my sources that there could be elements of Ulan's house, House Lalu, already in Ravenrock. Ravenrock is a small settlement, so it's hard to accomplish anything in secret. If any of them is from House Lalu, I wouldn't be able to make a move without them knowing. I had a feeling you'd be willing to listen to me. I need you to start out by being my eyes and ears. Search Raven Rock and see if you can root out these traitors. The best place to start would be Geldis Sadri, over at the Retching Netch Corner Club. If he provides you any leads, check them out before bringing them to my attention. We can't afford to make any mistakes. Traitors. The lot of them. Their collaboration with the Empire may have given them unrivaled political and economic strength, but their hearts weren't with the Dunma people. Lalu deserved every bit of hatred they received once the Empire released its grasp on Morrowind. Having passed ties to the Empire immediately turned them into the scapegoat for the Dunma people's suffering. They had welcomed the Empire with open arms and benefited from it. When everything was said and done, they were no longer recognized as a great house and were dismissed from the Council. I maintain a few contacts in other Dunmer settlements across Tamriel. Most hail from House Redoran, but there are a few from other houses. Most of my contacts live leagues away from Solstein. Sending the occasional message back and forth is all we can manage, and sometimes takes months or more to arrive. However, any information we can glean in times like this, I consider vital to House Redoran's survival. Don't worry. You can trust Geldis. He's been with us for a long time. For Mogul. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. Welcome to the Retching Netch Corner Club. Well, well. Agile's got himself a spy, does he? Azura knows he needs all the help he can get. He's been chasing the Ulins for years now. No. I just think he's going about this the wrong way. Actually, I do. 
If you want to catch those slippery slaughterfish, you need to let them come to you. There's an Ulan ancestral tomb near the temple. Someone's been leaving ash yam offerings on the altar inside. If you were to wait inside for whomever that is, I'm betting they'll have some of the answers you're looking for. What makes you think I have it? Any time Adril and the Redoran Guard made a move, the Ulans must have been one step ahead and didn't show up. You can thank me if it works. Until then, I'd head to the tomb and wait until your visitor shows up. Come back any time. My doors are always open. Maybe the frontier, but we've still got food. Break them and you'll want to be busy. Excuse me. I didn't realize there was anyone else here. I presume the same thing you're doing, leaving an offering for the departed. Forgive my surprise. It's just that I wouldn't expect that sort of behavior from someone who isn't Dunma. Since there aren't any Ulans left on this island, I've taken it upon myself to leave the traditional offering in their stead. What do you mean? I thought I was clear. I'm simply honoring a fellow departed Dunma. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'd like to meditate a bit. Can I help you? I hope Geld has proved useful. Have you made any progress? Tell us you. Are you sure? So Geldus's plan worked, eh? Every time we tried it, no one would ever show up. If Telesu's involved in any sort of plot to harm Councillor Morvain, I'm going to need hard evidence to prove it. I'm not kicking down anyone's door until I have solid evidence in hand. If you're wrong about Telesu, things would quickly go downhill around here, and the real culprits might slip away. I can't afford for that to happen. If you have evidence, and it places your life in peril, I would expect you to do whatever you must to keep yourself alive. Here, this key should open the front door of the manor in case they've locked it. Good luck. Telesu is wife to the family patriarch, Vendel. They have a single child, a daughter named Miri. They arrived here ten years ago and have been nothing but a... They are quite wealthy and they've been quite generous by share. They've contributed coin, food, supplies, even helped repair... People have mentioned it's a bit odd about how close in age Miri appears to be to her father, but that's hardly a cause for alarm. Just make sure you find solid evidence. If I accuse them without it, I'll be the laughing stock of the colony.
Come on. I think I we might have a visit. In here. For House Ulalu. For Villa Ulan. Spill your blood, Fetcher. Lost. You've brought Raven Rock. Did back you find any beach, evidence Father? at then we finally have them? All that remains now is chasing them down and bringing them to justice. Good. I'm going to send two of the best Rerer and Guard we have to take May them I have down. A word with you, counselor? I want you to assist them oh, any way you can. What troubles you? I was concerned about our See that you do. We can't no afford to so let these traitors journey. slip away. We might run out. Ash Fallow well, Citadel's been abandoned for a long time. Be ready for anything. With the Ashborn threat taken care of, I can give my men the rest they deserve. Well done, friend.
someone there.
What happened? Were you able to track down Vendor? Out with it! Malori, you need to talk some then, sense into your husband. It's finally you over. Get blood from a stone, what of the Redder and Guard? I sent to assist you. That is my problem. I was down with my lone guard. I was hoping to protect our people by sending them, not end up with casualties. To think that Vendel would stoop so low as to hire those fetchers. I'm glad you killed him. Wonderful. Simply wonderful. Counselor Morvane will be quite pleased when he hears about this. I don't know what you're playing at, Lava. Follow me, and I'll take you to the counselor so you can speak to him yourself. Considering the differences between us. I'm not talking about that. I have a knack for smelling trouble. For some reason we need it. I promise you, I have nothing but good intentions towards everyone in this town. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? I have some wonderful news. You've brought Ravenrock back from the brink, I Traveler. I don't know how to thank you. This visitor has single-handedly dealt with a threat that could have ended your life. Vendel, Telesu, and Miri Severin weren't who they appeared to be. I'm afraid they were here to avenge Villa Ulan's death. Vendel? But he's done so much for Ravenrock. How could this be possible? They did it to gain our confidence, Counselor. They had us all fooled. I should have been more vigilant. I'm sorry. Don't say that. It's not your fault, old friend. And you, step forward. What you've done for me, for all of Raven Rock, goes far beyond what I would have expected from a traveler to our town. For this, you have my deepest gratitude. Which I've done without question for now, over a hundred years. I'm certain Adriel was prepared to reward you appropriately for everything you've done. However, since a bit of coin hardly seems like enough, I've decided to provide something more substantial. Since the Severin family, or whoever they were, turned out to be criminals, their property is now forfeit. All we As counselor, make them I hereby award you Severin Manor and everything contained within. You've earned your citizenship here, and I hope you'll consider staying with us as a member of our community. The mines are open and the ebony has begun to flow because of your discovery. My eternal gratitude and blessings go with you.